Everyday Heroes is sponsored by the Great Greek Mediterranean Grill. So many people in our area going above and beyond doing great things for others. Here's some of the good news you may have missed this past week. Two South Carolina families whose loved ones gave the gift of life when they passed in San Diego earlier this month for the 2022 Transplant Games of America. Susan and Ben Morgan from Goose Creek made the trip to honor their son Rudy, who became a donor after passing away last year. The two went as part of We Are Sharing Hope SC, this state's organ procurement organization. Several people getting a second chance at life as the 39-year-old donated his heart, lungs, and both his kidneys. These transplant recipients competing in athletic events. Cleaning up Carolina, the Up to You program of the State Department of Natural Resources recognized a team of law enforcement officers with their inaugural award honoring the agency's top litter enforcers. It's a year-long statewide competition with bragging rights on the line. The team, which covers 12 counties in the northwest corner of our state, won this year's Golden Trash Can Award. But in total, nearly 39,000 pounds of trash were picked up. So thanks for the dedication and hard work of our law enforcement officers. A Monk's Corner man gathering donations for victims of the devastating flooding in Kentucky. Bill White from Kentucky, but he's lived amongst Corner for the past 23 years. And when he heard about the deadly flooding, he asked for donations on Facebook. And now he has several trailer loads full of items. People have dropped off clothes, food, water, and cleaning supplies. He will deliver his first load of supplies this week. It could happen here. And people would help me from up there and all of us. You know, it's just a, it's just a right thing to do. And as our children head back to class, United Way has helped more than 2,500 students get school supplies across the Tri-County area. Earlier this month, volunteers packed 2,700 backpacks with paper, pencils, erasers, and other supplies. Now those supplies distributed to elementary school students for the upcoming school year. Also, a special thanks to the Low Country Food Bank, a free food giveaway at Macedonia Church of our Lord Jesus Christ in North Charleston. Their mission, helping all people get the food they need, and they helped hundreds this week. If you'd like to nominate an everyday hero, email me at bclark at wcbd.com or go to our website, counton2.com, and hit the Everyday Heroes link.